Hello, my name is Craig Barron, and we are in the lobby of the Linwood Dunn Theater in Hollywood, California, with an exhibit of some of the artifacts, props, and miniatures that went into the making of the 1956 sci-fi classic Forbidden Planet. This is a 20-inch miniature of the C-57D space cruiser used in the filming of the special effects for Forbidden Planet. The hyperdrive, as you see below, is a light effect that allowed the crew of the United Planets cruiser C-57D to traverse the vast distances of space at faster than light speeds. We also have on display the prop control panel used to control the hyperdrive from the flying saucer. And as you can see, it has many unique control features like a minus infinity indicator. We also have one of the original hand prop lasers or blasters as it was called in the movie Forbidden Planet and as you can see I just can't resist picking it up and my only disappointment is that it doesn't really work. Also on display we have a collection of concept designs that are painted on photo enlargements from Arthur Lonergan's art department at MGM Studios. This unrealized sequence would have shown the id monster confronting Dr. Morbius, played by Walter Pidgeon, at the film's climax. In the 1970s, film historian Bob Burns rescued this artwork from a storage building on the MGM backlot that was slated for demolition. The artist who ultimately created these images is unknown.